Jacob Tammy announced his retirement from the NFL last week. I don't think it was anything that surprised anybody based on the fact he hadn't played all season. But nobody knows more about Jacob Tammy and playing football than Chuck Smith. He was Jacob's coach at Boyle County High School. He was on the Kentucky staff when Jacob was at Kentucky and has remained friends with Jacob all this time. In fact, Jacob even brought you to one of his first Super Bowl game, didn't he? He sure did. He sure did. Which must be a special thing for you. Oh, it was it was one of my bucket lists. I always wanted to go to a Super Bowl, and I was able to do that because uh, Jacob, uh, you know, invited me, provided the tickets and everything, and it was uh, it was a really a special. Uh, um, you know, moment for me and my wife, both of us got to go to the Super Bowl and it was it was awesome, it was a great game and uh, I wish Jacob could have won, but it still was a great experience. When he played for you here at Boyle County High School, Chuck, what your best memory or what kind of stands out to you about that time with Jacob? Well, Jacob was just a, he was just a great player. He just, he, um, he loved the, um, he loved the big moments, you know, the bigger the moment, the best, the better he played. And uh, he always found a way to go make the play, you know, that was going to decide the game, you know, whether it was, you know, early in the game or whether it was late in the game. Uh, but he is the type of guy that just wanted the ball when uh, the game was on the line. And um, he, he couldn't get enough of that. I mean, he just lived for that moment. And um, he was, you know, he's such a great player, he had great skills, ball skills, you know, he had all the tools. You know, uh, he was just a uh, just overall great player, and most people don't know, but he played corner for us as well. You know, he's and he's a, a six five, and he played corner. But I had a lot of interceptions. Didn't he? Had a lot of interceptions. He was a smart, very intelligent player. Um, he uh, and he liked to talk trash a little bit too. He, he, Jacob? Yeah, Jacob would tell him. Uh, he would tell him that you know uh, that this is the way it's going to be all game long. Yeah. And, and most of the same things you talked about there, when he got to Kentucky, they just carried on. It took a little while for him to kind of find his niche and get moved from receiver to tight end there. But the knack for making the big play, that continued his whole time at Kentucky and even in the NFL. Yeah, it, it just he just got that knack. And it, not only does he have the knack, he wants to. He wants, I mean, he really wants the ball. He really wants it thrown to him. He wants to be the guy that decides the game. And, you know, that's rare in, in athletes today. You know, they so most athletes today, you know, uh, the 95% of them was, uh, you know, I hope, uh, I hope we uh, hope it goes to somebody else, hope we win, you know. But he, he wants to be the guy. And I think that's really one of, the, one of the things, besides all of his skill and talent of ball skills that made him special, that's one of the things that made him really special. Now, I think probably those of us that know him, with all that he's done on the on the football field, what we still consider most special about him is just how he is when he's out away from sports, just how the Jacob Tammy is every day of the year. Every day. He's just an all-American guy. He really is. He's a good person. Comes from a good family. His mom and dad are special people, and they've done a good job with him. And um, and he is just a uh, you know just a all American guy. He really is. He just everything that he everything you see that's tr that's the true Jacob. You know, there's nothing phony about it. You know, the good thing about it, if you can just keep coaching long enough, you'll get to coach Jacob's son because there's yeah. no doubt Luke's going to be a football player. Oh yeah, he will be. Uh, it just kind of runs in their family. They love football, and uh, all the, you know him and Seth both are good football players. And but you know Jacob, Jacob's a special guy. He really is, and uh, he had what a wonderful career. I mean, nine years in the NFL and three um, Super Bowl teams. Three Super Bowl teams. I mean, he just had a, a, a just such a memorable uh, career. And the thing that if you're around Jacob, you know, long enough, you'll say, uh, well, he never even mentions it. He's very humble, very humble and uh, appreciative of, of uh, his success, uh, always willing to give credit to other people. But the fact of the matter is that uh, he wanted it, he worked for it, he earned it, and he deserved, it deserved every, everything he gets. Amen to that.